before I accessed the, the care assistance program, I was feeling alone, like nobody was hearing what I was saying. I found myself probably feeling more and more anxious, especially prior to birth parent visits. I realised that while, while part of it was very natural and normal, I think part of it I thought, you know what, I probably actually need some support. I do work as a therapist, so I have a lot of tools at my disposal um, and a great support network, but I still was experiencing a lot of private pain. As we got more stressed, then we were less able to be really present um, for the child in our care. What we were really noticing is how important the teamwork is between Alberto and I. I deal with it differently and yeah, when we have discussions about it, my response is probably a bit more how I would do it, but then obviously the support that Jade needs is different. So we were noticing that we weren't always on the same page um, and so we wanted to find a space where we could be safe and just talk through what was going on for us. Being a foster carer is such a unique experience. Your psychologist, they may have empathy and they may have the skill set, but they may not truly understand what it means to love a child, to let them go, to hope for them to return to mum and then to sit in despair that they're gone. I had a placement breakdown. It was just something I'd never really experienced before. Um, and I was recommended to contact the Care Assistance Program. My first phone call with the Care Assistance Program, it, it wasn't long, it wasn't a huge amount of time. I think we talked for just under an hour, but I found myself walking away just with a lightness, um, that feeling of, you know what, that burden that I was carrying before, that, that burden of not necessarily feeling understood, that weight was really lifted. And I thought, you know what, that was, I'm so glad I did that. The main benefit, I think, of the Care Assistance Program is that it, it does help you feel like you're being listened to. I mean, I've got some wonderful friends who would definitely listen to me, but with the CAT program, because they talk to other carers as well, uh, they can help you feel like this is not just happening to you, that you're not isolated, that this is the process and the system. The difference is having a neutral person for us to talk through but also someone who gets it someone who has worked in child protection who's um, been with foster care the system and can really understand and empathize with what you're going through with no judgment for newer foster carers for us um, also the sessions with the care assistance program helped us navigate the system and understand some of the other things that were available to us that we weren't aware of that we could be asking for as well i can't imagine that i would be a foster carer right now if it wasn't for cap it was useful in that it alleviated the isolation that i felt and, um, you know, that someone was walking alongside me that truly understood whether it was system challenges, whether it was grief and loss, or whether it was attachment breakdowns or difficulties in attachment. All aspects of my experience, I felt at the time were truly heard and understood. I was really looking for that, um, for someone to be with me in it all. I'm so glad that I made that space and was able to be honest with someone. It was a confidential space. You know, I could share some of those really hard things that our family was going through. It just probably gave us a bit of structure on how to deal with things. Like mm -hmm. we thought, should we be doing things this way? But it just reaffirmed that, yes, we're probably on the right track with how we're trying to approach things. The counsellor that we spoke to really reaffirmed to us that what we were doing was the right thing. It was okay to, you know, to have kids aware of how I was feeling as well and to work through that together as a family. Um, I found myself being a lot more transparent with our kids and saying, hey, you know what, Mama's actually having a hard time with this situation and I'm talking to someone um, and we're helping to work through that together. And even just the narrative in the kids, in them realising, hey, you know what, this is tricky. Um, and, and it's okay to talk to someone about that. 
um, I think they felt that lightness as well. You know what, we can do this together. We can really work through this arrangement all together, um, which was amazing. It's made me feel very worthy and heard, and that's been really important. I can understand why people might be concerned about reaching out for help. I think from my personal experience of using the care assistance program, it's easy to use, it's non-judgmental, and it's there to support you. Um, I have found in life using professionals to help you work things through is just so helpful to be part of your toolkit doesn't mean there's anything wrong with you it just means that there's some support there for you and in the end it's going to help you be a better uh, foster carer and be um, better within yourself and taking care of yourself